I see all over YouTube now little videos about housewives and guys wanting to tell you the truth about solar. And these are kind of tiny house nation guys out in the Montana wilderness talking about how you have to make sacrifices to live off grid with solar because of the long winters and you can't use the vacuum when you're using the dryer and you have to wait to take a shower because the well pump runs on electricity and you have to run the air conditioner up at 88 degrees because you don't want to use too much electricity because you don't have very much. Well, I don't want to wait to use the dryer or the vacuum cleaner. And I like the house to be 70 or 71 in the heat of summer and 74 or 75 in the cold of winter. And that takes power. I deeply believe in improving life on Earth through the use of the development of technology. But I don't want to suffer for the planet. That's not the mission here. It's to live a normal life and even a energy rich life using the magic rocks of photovoltaic panels and lithium batteries to do it. And I'm convinced more so now than ever before that it's actually quite doable. But my vision of solar is big solar, enough solar and enough storage to run a full-size home in comfort year-round without really depending on the utility grid at all. And that takes some doing, and it comes at some expense. 